Hello, hello, welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, you guys, happy Friday. Hello, for those of you that are new to me, hi, my name is Brooke Sidney. I'm your mind, soul, full mentor, your self-love advocate, and your inner voice and soul story coach. And, you know, basically what I do is I hop on, um, not only to talk about things that are happening in my life, but hoping that some of the stories that I share and some of the insights will resonate with you to help you move forward in your life because when everybody is rocking and rolling in their lives doing what God spirit has for them wow you know how the consciousness and the earth will change but anyway I'm hopping on today because I wanted to share this insight that I have gotten so I am in the process of really reviewing 2018. I hope that you are doing that as well. For me, I am going back through, looking at everything from income, like taxes, all that good stuff, to programs that I've launched, to things that I've done, to people that I've worked with, and really sitting back and saying, what do I need to know so that I can propel my business and my life forward so that I can be a better, I can be a better mind soulful mentor, better coach, um, helping people, right? In all the areas that I serve, because that's how I look at it. I look at it as serving. And I'm really asking, how can I do this better? What am I missing? Perhaps what are my blind spots? So I've been doing this, right? I've been doing it for a minute. Um, conscious work. And then I really started asking, Sorry, I'm switching hands here, just keeping it real. I really started asking God, Spirit, what am I not seeing? What am I not seeing? Because when we, um, as human beings, we look at things very much in our own lane, in our own vision, and we can develop tunnel vision right we can see things the way we've been seeing them and as a result our lives um our lives can we may we may miss things right not just bad things like what could i do differently but also all of the good things so i have really been like kind of really in this space of trying to figure out how can i can how i can improve right and it's so interesting the i feel like uh, revelations and the information that I'm receiving. So one of the things I really thought about that has come through for me, and so it might resonate with you, is to ask for help. And I don't just mean like from your friends and people around you, you can and you should, for those that you trust, because you can't let everybody speak into your life. You have to be um, very discerning about who can speak into your life and who can speak into your spirit just keeping it 100 if you want to talk more about that or learn more about that you know definitely jump into one of my programs um talk to me book a clarity chat so we can really you know drill down and i can give you more about that but you know you have to make sure that you are working with or talking to someone who can truly speak life into you and your situation because you want to guard your heart you know even the bible tells us that so my point is that you don't have to do this reflection period alone. You don't have to do this reflection period alone. You can call on not only people like myself, hey, I'm here, I'd love to help. I'd love to help bring more clarity to um, how you review your 2018, as well as getting you ready for 2019. So book a clarity chat, but call on God or whatever that means to you. Call on God, call on spirit, Listen to that inner voice, listen to the inspirations, listen to the information that you receive and keynote, start listening and paying attention to what starts coming across your path, right? What starts happening for you? The people that start showing up, the messages, the songs, right? The music, the tunes, the lyrics, start listening to those things, start paying attention, to the people that are in your life that you know feel good and are there to help you grow. Um, this is such an amazing lesson for me in 2018. There have been people, or maybe even one particular person in my life that has given wisdom and I wasn't listening all the time. And so make sure you're listening. Um, you know, definitely, like I said, check, check words against spirit. 
check words against your inner, you know, guidance system, your inner voice, um, you know, run it, run it back, right? Run it back, run it through. But make sure we are not only doing our reflection periods by hearing, you know, our known, our known logical thoughts and looking at it from that way, but make sure we're also asking for help so that we can see beyond our own tunnel vision so we can have total vision, right? We can have people reflecting back sometimes some of the things that we are unable to see, our blind spots areas for growth so that we can fully grow and step into greatness, step into all the things that we are called to do, be, and freaking have, okay? So I just wanted to jump on, let you know about that. If you're interested, um, definitely book a clarity chat. It can only help, right? It can only help, um, help you get clear about your 2018, um, help you get clear about your 2019. I will ask you some powerful questions that will help you see things I know a little bit differently. The other part is make sure that you're on my list for my gratitude challenge. Hello, gratitude challenge. We all need a little bit more gratitude and it helps us see the wins that we're having in our life. I'm always working on that, right? I'm always working on that. I am coming to you from a place of things that I have learned and things that I continue to grow and work on, right? So that's on the reel. And then also, um, if you haven't grabbed a mama love planner and you are a busy woman and you are trying to schedule your self care, you need to grab one of those and use self care as the code to say 20%. But yes, I'm just hopping on because I felt this in my spirit that I needed to share it. Um, I love really growing through what I'm going through. And I would love sharing that with people, hearts and souls that are resonant and really want to hear this and also want to move and shake up things in their own lives. If that's you, I am talking to you. So have a blessed and amazing Friday. Go out and make it and do all the things you want to do. And I'll see you next time.